previous video we created the pagination as you can see that click on blocks and you've got all of the pagination there right but this simple loader is not looking that great what you might have seen generally on Facebook or other websites you know uh, let's go to Facebook let me see. okay let's leave Facebook for now but you get some kind of an animation it looks like the posts are loading right so we're going to create that so I'm going to save time and not spend too much time in typing all of all the content but we'll go back to our okay we have that already post loader awesome so um, instead of just displaying simple loading I'm gonna put this okay and this uh, right here HRF hash okay so this is basically the same content that was being used to display these posts if you do an inspect element uh, I've just copied this post wrapper and I have gone ahead and um, you know taken this whole content and just given this height so whatever the height of this was I put the, the same for the, the first element whatever the height of the P was I put that to the P element and whatever the height for loader uh, sorry whatever the height for the image was I was just taken like uh, 300 pixel or something and then just given, given that to the, uh, this image as well and then similarly for these as well so it looks like they're it would look like they're loading and instead of using you know gifs which a lot of websites use i have just used a simple css so over here all i'm doing is just uh, using the keyframes like gradient background just giving these elements a fixed height a background image size and just adding this uh, you know animation to infinity so now if we go ahead and go on to next page there you go so if you do observe there you go you can see that nice little effect is coming right click on blocks again it's loading click on, and you click on the nine again you can see that it's being loaded right so it looks like the, the data is being loaded and you don't see like a sudden jump or content shifting uh, which gives a better user, user experience okay so you can use that or you can use the loader the traditional style if you want to use it it's completely up to you all right brilliant awesome so in the future videos we can always uh, you know link all of these to their author pages to their taxonomy pages and all of that but that's something for you to explore if I get time I'll create one uh, as well but it's pretty simple and you should be able to do this yourself okay so I hope that was brilliant and if you did like it, please give a thumbs up, do subscribe to my channel, uh, do follow me on GitHub and Twitter. And if you have any questions, leave a comment and I'll be happy to answer that. Brilliant. Awesome. So I'll see you in the next video. And if you, if you want me to make any specific video, you can always you know, leave a comment. And if I get time, I will. Okay. Thank you very much.